My name's Erin Murphy. I'm an engineering degree apprentice at JCB. And I work in the innovation team. I'm Lee Harper, Chief Engineer of Product Innovation at JCB. So I've recently completed 20 years of service and I started it as an apprentice engineer in the research department. And then in terms of manufacture and assembly, what, what route will we go through Erin to assemble this? So it will be built up in two parts of the undercarriage first, yeah. and then blue body, and then put all of the electrical components in quite similar to so, the... as a sub-assembly on the top? Yeah. I've been very fortunate in my career to be involved in lots of fantastic projects, but the highlight for me will be our pioneering range of electric machines. And actually the, the origins of the work on the electric machine, I was fortunate enough to begin with within my apprenticeship. So okay. back in about 2006, we started to experiment with electric powertrain technology oh, really? when I was an apprentice, but the technology wasn't right and ready to deploy then. Mm -hmm. We learnt a lot of the skills and formed a lot of the knowledge that we had that when that technology became mature enough and sensible enough to turn into a product to sell, mm -hmm. that's how we, we leapt through into that. So that journey really started on my apprenticeship <laughs> and concluded in, in yours. Yeah. <laughs> So I've been at JCB for four years now and I'm due to come off scheme in the next couple of months. I have worked in 13 different teams across excavators, innovation, power systems and transmissions. I've really enjoyed innovation because it's just such a varied role and we get to work on such different exciting stuff. So Erin, tell me about some of your other placements in, on your apprenticeship and what you've learned there. Yeah, so I did a placement over at Power Systems. Mm -hmm. I was working in build shop, so working hands on like building up the machines and then did some time in testing as well. So we were able to get them on the test rigs um, in the test cells down there. So I also did quite a bit on hydrogen stuff as well while I was there. I did placements in calibrations and electrical while I was there as well and then did a placement in OEM as well. So a really um, broad range of um, experience there and a, yeah. an ability I can see to bring academic knowledge with practical hands-on uh, application too. As well, it was experience that I wouldn't have been able to get if I'd have gone to uni full time. Absolutely, Because yeah. I wouldn't have been able to like, have hands-on with the actual engine, which is how you can learn. And like I find I learn so much better if I'm hands-on. And stuff. that's it, and it's accelerated your learning. And, and yeah launched you into a career within engineering in yeah. its own right. Yeah, definitely. My advice to an apprenticeship applicant would be to get started now. Get into the scheme, immerse yourself and then lap up the experience that it brings. Make the most of all opportunities that you can. Try and understand as much of a wide range of the business as you possibly can while you're on scheme. <laughs> <laughs>